What's up guys? We're here with the Cole Train. We're gonna do a little Q&A with him today. Your host, Lexus Colby. I am currently in the hot chair, AKA my busted up desk chair. And uh, we're gonna be getting to know each other, letting the viewers know what our personal interests are and uh, just get to know us better. Um, I did a Q&A last year, but this time around we're gonna get just a little more lifestyle like Sprinkle some BMX in there, but you know, we're gonna we're gonna do it up today, and uh, bro, we'll do me, and then uh, hopefully later in the month you'll learn a little bit about Lexi, and uh, we're gonna keep this YouTube going, and uh, we're gonna have a good year. We're starting 2024 off, 2024 off right with a bang. With a bang. All right. Our first question for Spencer Cole is, what are your goals for 2024? Um, well, this season I'm going to be more U.S. based. Um, last year was my last year in the U23 class. Got to travel the world, got to be on Team USA at the Worlds. Um, this year my goals are a little bit different. I would just like to work on myself and get better at the USMX Pro Races. Um, I made two main events in the Pro class last year and one in Elite Men UCI. So I would like just to make more consistent mains in the Pro Men class. And uh, yeah, Worlds, it, it's hard with the way the points work for me jumping up from U23 to Elite. Um, I would have to attend the World Cups to get there. Um, not sure if that's in the cards at the moment. So just for now, um, keep improving. Um, pro men, make some main events. Focusing on that USA BMX series. Exactly. Just get some more money events and uh, let's have some fun. Yeah. Next we got favorite cheat meal. <sighs> I feel like I... I might have done this in my first Q&A, but my taste buds changed. I know I said crumble cookies last year. Mm -hmm. I know I, on my that's last Q&A I said crumble cookies. But, and I know I said Skyline Chili. Did you get chili. burnt out on them? My dad killed it for me. Yeah. I even said, I feel like I said this. I might want to go back and find the footage and send this in. Yeah. And say like, my dad loved crumble. My dad's got a whole brand new batch of crumble cookies all laid out. So I feel like I'd be in trouble if I didn't say that. He's big into the sweets. So yeah. he burnt it out. Not, yeah. not saying if they ever approached to sponsor me, I would say no, because... Oh, well, who would turn down a cookie sponsorship? Not me. Especially not for me. <laughs> Raspberry me. cheesecake from Crumple yeah. Cookie. <laughs> yeah, some, I mean, there was a couple weeks where their flavors weren't really it. Well, yeah. I okay, I have a big thing to say. If they're like the ones that have like the fruit in them, okay. they're great. But you think so? Yeah, because they... See, I'm more of a sweet kind of gal. Okay, that's like that's like my dad. Yeah, you my my favorite one it would probably be the the pancake one. You know what I'm talking about? No. I'm gonna sure there's a. We're turning this cutie into a crumble <laughs> cookie. <laughs> right right now. Now. <laughs> Maybe we'll just have to. What, <laughs> what what did my dad say on the way home from the track today? That we could stop by his work if we wanted crumble. Yep. On to the next question. Enough crumble. Your mom's calling you. <laughs> Should we answer it? <laughs> Hey, Shelly. <laughs> hey, Mom. How are you doing, brother? I'm doing YouTube. Do you want to say hi to everyone? <gasps> Mama Who's cool. everyone? Say hi to the, all the people watching. Hi to all the people watching. What are they watching? Spencer Cole YouTube. We got Starbucks before this video, so we could be hyped up for you guys. All right. All right. Now we got... What are your race day tunes? Race day tunes? Yeah. It's been kind of, you know, flowing around a little mm -hmm, bit. Mm -hmm. um, He's getting into some country music. A little bit. Yeah. A little bit. Yeah. You can't go wrong with the top two. Bring Me The Horizon and... Um, well, no. Top three. Bring Me The Horizon, MGK, and Pierce the Veil. Okay. I can't... Yeah. I can never choose between those three. It's kind of a mix of everything. I like it. Hey! Come here. Sure. Come here. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with a cameo. I'm not camera ready. <laughs> Cheers. Sage, what's uh Wait. Cheers. Cheers. What? What's your uh favorite piece of supercross merch that you received from Bill? I have this top right here, but I'd say the tank top little crop mm. version of okay. it. That's my favorite. Sweet. Thanks. A little input from the sis. Bye, right, goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Um Wait. Uh yeah. Ray Stay Tunes. Ray Stay Tunes. Uh, Bring Me The Horizon, MGK, Pierce Seville, but mm. there's one artist that has been creeping up on my list. Sorry guys, I had um, a little bit of a wardrobe change. I'm not sure if anyone wants to read this or knows what this means, but. Yeah, so now that we know that there's an underground artist climbing up your list. Yes. What's your favorite Taylor Swift song? <laughs> Listen to. 
Taylor Swift Haunted from Speak Now. Taylor Trojan, hit it. Sorry guys, I had to get you know something in there for my Swifties. Emily, a little special shot. That was for you. <laughs> All right, now we are on to favorite sport of outside of BMX. If anyone knows me, this is the easiest answer in the yeah. world. It matches the brand pretty well too. Yeah. The yeah. name. I'm big into Supercross guys. <laughs> like it's, it's not even funny. It's it's an addiction for him. Like he knows all the stats. It, it's bad. Team rider. I, I might know what to eat for breakfast. Like who won Glendale last year? Glen oh, Tomac. Yep. That was his there 50th career and that's the last one he had. It's Here weird. Here we are. Here we are with the stats. Well, we have, right. there's a, like a, do we have a side question with that? Um, who's your favorite rider? Favorite rider? Yeah. Oh man. It, it was always Chad Reed. Like day Chad one, Reed. I'm a diehard Chad Reed fan. Who's your favorite rider out of the field now? Oh, it's it's Ken Roxon, but I'm also a big Chase Sexton yeah, guy. Yeah. But, and I it was they kind of go hand in hand. Yeah, and you guys might have just seen. I went to the Baker's factory. Um, hopefully that video is popping up. I got to watch uh, Craig, Malcolm, Plessinger, Hampshire, all those guys ride. It was it was really cool. Um, hopefully that video is <laughs> up and running. And you guys get to see that. It was a really cool opportunity. Yeah, yeah. I'm jealous. So all right, well. Now we got, oh, this goes hand in hand with it too. Does it? Who do you predict to be the 450 Supercross champion? Rachel, my dog, asked me on Instagram. <laughs> I had to add it into this. I knew this would be coming. It's going to be Chase Sexton. Yeah. Going back to back, new team, new Have him. The confidence. I hope, I feel like a lot of the viewers are going to be watching Supercross as well. You yeah, know? Yeah. It, so let us there. know down below Who's who winning? you think is going to win yeah. the 2024 Let's bench race in the comments. Yeah. yeah. Who, who's got it this year? Let's see. Starting this Saturday, we have our Anaheim, yeah. Anaheim one with Sarasota. Right when we get back home, mm -hmm. we have another Anaheim one. So yeah. tune in to USMX to watch Sarasota, and then right after that, go and watch Supercross. Yeah. It's like a holiday on Saturday. Yeah. Looking Saturday forward to it. is great. Let's get a lot it. of racing going on Saturday. All right. Um, are you in school? I am. Mm -hmm. okay. I am attending Lindsay Wilson online. I am on a collegiate um, cycling. Uh, scholarship and uh, I get to I think doing racing and going to school is a good opportunity especially with the scholarships that these schools provide I agree. Um, and I'm able to go full online which is something really cool um, I've been on campus I've met all my, my teammates for collegiate I think it's really cool um, a lot of good people have come out of there and uh, coming up and I think it's either March or April I will be taking you guys along with me for collegiate nat champs in uh, Missouri. Okay. It is on an indoor track. That will be gnarly, probably a really soft track. And uh, it'll be cool, you know. When is it? Uh, I think it's March or April. Okay. It's, it's on a, you know, it's a smaller national, but it will have collegiate nat champs, which would be cool. It'd be a cool opportunity to try and win another sleeve. Yeah. This time in yeah. the school field. Um, be awesome. I'll be having the Lindsey Wilson jersey on that weekend. So it would be a cool, good experience. Um, I'll definitely vlog it, you know, share it with you guys. I think it's a good message, you know, to get out there. You know, you can race, you can go to school and you can make it happen. So mm -hmm. I think it's cool. Yeah, I agree. I like I'm starting it. business and marketing, by the way, if anyone's wondering that. Um, yeah. Next, we got fave outside activity. Oh, sorry. You wrote this down weird. Favorite? <laughs> wow. Favorite activity outside of BMX. Okay. <laughs> Wasn't that hard? <laughs> you wrote fave outside of BMX activity. <laughs> Speaks for itself. Um, Man, I would. I just like hanging out with my homies. Um, he yeah. likes doing the Xbox tourneys. Oh yeah, no, I'm onto the PC stuff. I'm a big oh. MX bikes guy now. Um, Sorry. Watch Sorry. out for Coltrane on there. Um, and yeah, so basically hanging out with my friends. Um, we like to do some stupid stuff all the time. Smart stupid stuff. Oh, and uh, yeah, game with the homies. And yeah, I, I keep it pretty home base for the most part. You know, not too crazy. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, just keep it keeping the fun. Yeah. All right, next we got favorite Supercross product. Ooh, mm. there's a lot to choose from. Yeah, there is a lot of things to choose I would think from. there's like levels to this question because you have the merch. What's, what's your favorite merch? We'll start with that. Okay. Come on. Okay, Come let's on. see it. Hold on. Let's see it. Give me one second. Pause. Do you guys know what I'm doing right now? I think everyone should know. What I'm doing right now. Okay. <laughs> what was the question again? Of course, of course. Favorite Super Ross product, merch. 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 It's on my head. Yeah. You guys don't see me with us. I live in Florida. 
Yeah, he always wears a beanie and jeans, and he lives in the heat. <sighs> What's next? All right. Um, favorite track on the USA BMX tour. Oh, okay. So this is USA BMX specific. Yeah, specific. Okay. Um, I feel like it's biased if I say Oldsmar, but I do think it's the best racing track. Honestly, it has like I feel like you can win from gates one to gate eight. It mm -hmm. curves well for for the eight meter. Like yeah. this is this is based off. There are different tracks that I like better. I'd say off the the five meter mm -hmm. for Oldsmar, but say we're racing off the eight meter as a pro, I would say Oldsmar because all lanes have a chance to win. The turns are bold and they are probably some of the best for passing. Um, the rhythm's fun. The pro set flows well and international competition comes yeah. over and it's it makes it trip. good. Yeah. But, but would you say it's your favorite race on the circuit too? Yes, but that's hometown my favorite eight meter. So sure. yeah, hometown crowd, that's cool. Okay. Um, if we're gonna go on with the question, Small Hill, what's my favorite Small Hill track? Um, that's, I'm, I mean, I put this on myself. <laughs> yeah, you asked yourself this <laughs> asked question. Myself this. All right, throwback. I'll go 2016 Louisville. That okay. was beautiful. 2016, right. wait, was it 20? No, 2014. Sorry. Sorry. 2014 Louisville. I can't believe and you mess up the year like that. I'm starting to be a fan of Nashville. Okay. Um, it I might, like Nashville. It might not fit my style of riding yeah. that well, but I would say it's fun. It's high speed. Yeah. It's different. It's way different. It's the different. turns are the smoothest in the circuit. Like yeah. Yeah, there's nothing like it at all. Yeah. So. Classic first straight there, have to say. Drag strip. You guys should see a video soon about that. You might have already no. seen it. Oh, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Who knows? More content. Brings us to our final question. Um, what's your favorite TV show? <sighs> this is hard because I'm a nerd. <laughs> like, I don't and know. Maybe you, it's hard for him to pick just one. I don't know if you guys know, like, my interests, like, are off the charts with like anything it's like, like superhero-like, Star Wars. Like, it's like an eight-year-old boy. I am. It's bad. Um, <laughs> shoot. I mean, this is hard. Okay. Um, I would definitely say favorite as, of all time. As oh, that's all. No. Okay. Okay. Right uh, now, what's your favorite? Right now, uh, the boys. But okay. I'm not sure if that's appropriate for all viewers to watch. Okay. Um. So like that's that's one really cool for my for the adult viewers. Uh, the boys on Amazon. That's awesome. Um, I love all the Marvel shows. Like Loki season two is incredible. I like the story behind that one. Ah oh, man, if there's one more. Oh, I'm also a horror geek. Um, Chucky had a really good show. There's three seasons of that going. That's like top level horror nerd stuff though. I'm telling you, my my interests are branching everywhere. Oh, but man. yeah, I would say like those. They okay. kind of spring around. And yes. if you want to have some summer vibes, I'm really basic. I like Outer Banks as well. Yeah, yeah. That I wish my friend Zach would watch it. He hasn't watched it? No. Oh my gosh. Have you I watched thought, it? Yeah, of everyone, course. Everyone, everyone has watched it. Watch Outer Banks. Okay, and like they have a really cool vibe. I like John B's hair. Uh -huh. They live the life, honestly. Yeah, I want to run away. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay. <laughs> All right, guys, that is all for my second Q&A on the channel. This is the 2024 edition, I would say. Yeah, um, renewed it, you know. Yeah, renewed it. We got, like, this was, you know, we had a sprinkle of BMX, but this was more about, you know, you. getting to learn you some interest and, you know, learning more about me as, like, a person and everything behind that. So, yeah. got some cool interest and yeah, we're having a good time. Mm -hmm. Next up, we're going to start with uh, Lexi, and uh, she will have a Q&A on the channel as well. Yep, um, yep. And uh, yeah, we're gonna be my my first Q and A. First Q and A. Yep. Get used to it. Yeah. So we'll try and do some BMX, some personal. Yeah. We'll do both. Have some fun. All right, guys. Thank you for tuning in. Like and subscribe to the channel. Check out the merch that we mentioned, especially this white beanie, because I'm obsessed with it. Ladies, this little crop top is so cute. You heard it from Sage as well. Yeah. She loved that yeah. one. And All right, guys. Top. Oh, can you let me end the video? Sorry. She loves this thing. I do too. I am. <laughs> All right. Thanks, guys. We'll see you soon.